called Mr. Walsh from the uh, transfer station and spoke to him this morning. He called me back and said that things were progressing. And he was calling Bill. And he called you. I guess you, you called, called him twice back. When I called him back. We, we just missed each other. So. To make an appointment to bring the letter to introduce them. I don't know exactly where we're headed, and they, they made a lot of progress. I, I, I would want to, I'd like some guidance on that issue. I wasn't around during the negotiation of that lease. Um, and I know it's a, I mean, this is, it's a big deal for the town. I mean, that's a big, big project that the town stands to realize, you know, considerable amount of money. Uh, I know the town was represented by council when they negotiated the lease. There's been a change in the entity um, that we're dealing with, and I know that the entity says that he took over, you know, the old company. Uh, however, I think, I think to be on the safe side, we should have council really review all the documents and make sure that the town, you know, we want to make sure that the town is getting what we understand is our benefit for that bargain and I, you know not having been present while this well, the, you know the initial negotiations were going on I, I don't you know sometimes things get get lost through the cracks if I wasn't here I wouldn't know I, I really would feel more comfortable if we had counsel special counsel really look at this and uh, well you'd have and, to have a special counsel yeah. for the Certain expertise involved in it. Yeah, it's I, a, I it's, thought the it's fellow that we had the last time was good, but we might as well have someone else to watch his work and yeah. find out what really has to happen because things change, times change, different people are involved. And I don't think there's anything wrong with having a good professional advice. So My understanding is that the lease the general understanding of the benefits of that lease are that the town is going to be getting their trash picked up for nothing, which is a benefit probably close to $400,000 or so, or more money. half a million dollars a year. You said it was seven fifty when we stopped. When we stopped picking it up, we were getting, spending seven fifty at that time. Then, oh, oh that's right, because we charged the residents. Yeah and it offsets our cost. <clears throat> then in addition to that, for every you know tonnage we're gonna receive revenue back, uh, and the estimate is approximately $500,000 a year. So if they go to the 1,000 tons, it'll be 540. The building is has a capacity of 3,000 tons a day. My point is, <clears throat> with, a, with an agreement that the town stands to realize such a huge amount of money. I mean, this, you, that, that, that is a once-in-a-lifetime type of opportunity for the, for the town. We, we, sh we should get the, my opinion, we should get the best ways there are to, to deal with it. I know that, you know, there's a couple of top-notch land use type of lawyers that um, don't come cheap, but when you're talking about that much money, I, my recommendation is to, to, to see if we can uh, retain them. And I think that's a good it, idea. I think it's a good idea to wait a while, too, before we let them make more of a commitment, before we say we want to negotiate. So the, the, the next step, though, is for you to touch base with Jack Walsh, mm -hmm. and, and, and that he'll bring, now he came to a meeting about four months ago with two gentlemen. And were they, were they, they, I thought they were the new they were um, partners. Yes. Right. So yes. it's the same group. This is going to be the individual himself. Mr. Bostick. Mr. Chair, yeah. is the lease agreement for, uh, null and void from the previous um, enterprise, or is it still it, in it's, it's It's not supposed to be. Uh, it's a different entity that we're dealing with. Um, the lease agreement still the transfer. It's still it's transfer. That's what we were told. That the, the, the lease transferred over to the new owners. I I know. Yeah. But I we know. need to. Right. I, that's what that's what Bill's talking about. Making sure that all that 
was was done properly. And I mean, to be on the safe side, you'd want the new entity, the principals of the new entity, to enter into the lease agreement. Right. Yeah, assign themselves. Yeah. You know, I, I okay. Would. okay. Great. Thanks. As a football player, I was used to getting knocked down, but I always bounced back. Then an infected mosquito bit me, and I almost died. Mosquitoes can carry serious viruses like Triple E and West Nile virus. So protect yourself and the people you care about. Use mosquito repellent with DEET. Limit being out from dusk to dawn. Wear more protective clothing. Keep your screens in good shape, and get rid of standing water around your house. These simple steps can help prevent mosquito bites and keep you healthy this summer.